Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. So one person he wrote to Hakim Zaman he's saying that uh, wearing older clothes or wearing dirty clothes it creates uh, humility. It creates uh, humility or because uh, in kesar tawadu. So this is why we're like I don't really got him away. I I wear it is well I don't know the full details but he's saying that regarding this. So he said no, no not true. He says that yes, wear normal simple clothes. Wear uh, normal simple clothes. Don't wear very expensive or clothes which will grab people's attention, which are uh, jazabul in nazar. Right? But don't make it d dirty because because it says in different riwayat and different wording, or even the muslim the, the the principle established. You shouldn't humiliate yourself. And if you wear uh, clothes excess clothes that are way beyond the average. You have, you have capacity, one is you don't, you're poor, what are you going to do, can't afford anything, no problem. But one is you can afford it, but you wear something well beyond the average of people. So uh, humility would be, I'm not going to wear something very expensive. You have the average, even if it's average, slightly on the lower end of average, but it's acceptable, and that's okay, that's your humility. But you do something which is really, really below the average of people, and that stands out in a bad way. Yes? Then he goes, that's not really humility, you're actually humiliating yourself. So sometimes you have to, is that there's a, a mix-up between humility, and humiliation. So humility is you adopt something which is what is standard, slightly below standard, but it's not so low that it looked down upon or frowned upon as being like, you know, disgraceful, disgraceful. If the person who you look at is disgraceful, that's his fault. He might not be of like, for example, somebody's like a I don't know, a billionaire and he thinks he's wearing like so this stove is disgraceful, his beard is disgraceful, but your your disgraceful look doesn't matter. But what an average person who's of your society, of your circles, look as being acceptable, then that's fine. Something like that. But then to go so low on purpose, without, you, without any majburi, any uh, istirar, then this is now not really humility, it's actually tadhilidun nafs. And in hadith and different things, you should not humiliate yourself. That's what comes in the hadith, the words that, that don't humiliate yourself. And Prophet said, how can you humiliate yourself? They asked the Prophet and he said, when you take a responsibility which you can't manage, because you'll fail in the end, and then you humiliate yourself. Yes, and, he goes, and then he goes one step further, is that those who have, those who are people of deen, the Imams, the Masjid, the Mudarris, uh, you don't have to go out, don't have the excessive, but make sure you, you dress and you conduct yourself in a way where it shows that, no, this person is, he, he's not dumb, he's not dopey, he's not so low. So I actually tell that, he, he has saliqa, he has the ability to do things properly. Yes, so he may not be over inclined to getting really expensive clothes and everything, but the clothes he has, he, he's the clean, the decent, they're well kept, he's smart. Yes, but again, Everybody can use it to suit their the wishes and whims and fancies. Somebody who wants to just be like, you know, uh, dress ex excessively, say, yeah, we have to make sure that we'll dress properly. So, you know, 100 pound jubba. You can, you can excuse everything. What he's trying to say here is dress in a way, dress in a way where you're smart, you're clean, you're tidy, and you're presentable. Yes. In the, according to the people in front of you. Right? And bring something clothes dirty on purpose is not, not part of the thing.